Yeah, so like that, when you have dreams where um, people are jumping off bridges, um, it is a, um, it's a warning that someone's stepping off their spiritual path. It's a warning that someone's deviating from the right path. And she was on the bridge and these kids were getting her onto the bridge and then committing suicide and telling her to bring me to them. And that's dark side. She said they were laughing and everything, they were happy. So it's like the dark side know they're gonna try and lure me off my spiritual path. Yeah. They And lure her as well. Now Martin had a dream <coughs> where, he was on the, where he was on the phone talking to me smoking weed which means spiritual ascension, and he got stabbed in the face. And he said to me, what does that mean? And I said, you're going to get caught up in gossip, scandal, and lies. So be careful what you say to people. Leave at the second exit. So now I'm wondering, because I keep being told wolf in sheep's clothing, no, leave wolf in sheep's clothing, wolf in sheep's clothing. So it's made miles. me hypervigilant, it's made road. me, you know, um, <clears throat> Spirit actually said to me the other day, which I found really interesting and quite profound, but I don't know whether I saw it somewhere and then it was replayed in my head or whether they just said it, but they said, a person who claims to be innocent is spiritual a person who shows their flaws has ascended and why is she having dreams about saving my husband from king kong i told her i've been saying to her he's going to be dealing with a great betrayal I can feel it. He's going to be dealing with something where he's about to see the truth in a situation that is going to be a great betrayal. And I've, I've, I'm telling you, they think I'm the great betrayer. <coughs> they will not explain any of this to him. If they go to him with stuff, it would have proven me right on every single level. But it's the dreams. I'm just documenting this for the dreams because um, I just keep thinking about the way she said these kids were so happy. She said some of them were so little, like, you know, four or five years old. So, um, I, you know, I, I am expecting a student uproar. But I will be completely innocent, I know that, because like I've I've not done anything I haven't admitted to and, and won't admit to, it's just nobody lets me explain why, because they see me as being the bad guy and they don't realise the importance of what it is I'm trying to teach them. Because you can't, you can't be spiritual without ascending. changed it for you like when was that moment where you thought right i'm dealing with all the darkness and that i'm like what changed it for you i'll turn this off